Hello guys, today I just want to quickly show and recommend to you one small package, small helper. So Laravel is full of helpers by default, but for some things there are packages, so ours helper. It's usually for those projects that need to deal with time, specifically with hours for appointments or scheduling or something like that. So that helpers would help you to generate the collection of time slots or timestamps between our x and our y or hour and minutes so default example for example if you want to generate slots every 30 minutes from 8 a.m to 9 30 this would be the result i didn't prepare a specific demo video for that because it's pretty clear how to use that or for a specific example of just this problem i have one of the components on my livewirekit.com which is time availability and for stuff like that, I have a separate demo video and I will link that in the description below for date time availability. So imagine you pick a date and then those time slots appear. Some of them booked, some of them are free. So just to populate that collection, this package would be a massive helper and it has more parameters as well. So you may provide format of how it is returned. You may exclude sometimes, for example, for a break, lunch, or siesta, or whatever, then it also may go past midnight and may also include multiple days. So, for example, if you want to show the calendar of available hours, time slots for a few days in a row up front. And also, you can find more examples in the test directory. Let's take a look at those. This is also a good example of how to write tests. So, this is the default example every 15 minutes, then date time format example then midnight example, then the default formatting, then the dates, then 12 hour format, multiple days, excluding times, excluding dates, excluding multiple time intervals. So pick which case is more relevant for you. But generally, I do think it's a great package for those who work with time slots. Or maybe you can recommend some other package for this, or maybe you implemented that without a package in some elegant way. Share your experience in the comments below as usual. I like those discussions happening there. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.